Hey YouTube, this is David M. Uh, I am doing a user review on the Pro Stretch and the Pro Stretch Plus. Uh, right here, this is the Pro Stretch. This is the first model, and this is the Pro Stretch Plus. Um, what these I tools do, the they are ultimate tool to release increase flexibility in the calves, hamstrings, Achilles tendon, plantar fascia, and toes. Um, we will I'll do a review first on this pro stretch. Uh, the reason why I got this, uh, I have a Achilles tendonitis pain at the Achilles insertion. It's the very hard part right at the back of your heels, right where the Achilles meets the bone. Um, for some reason, whenever I start doing any physical activity or anything like that, it starts to hurt, and then um, you know it's kind of it's a real pain in the ass after going to the diagnosis a couple times, try, try to figure out the issue, got an MRI, everything looked fine. Um, there was just a little bit of swelling there. Um, I went there to get an MRI right after I started having some issues uh, when I went paintballing. So um, I went, you know. So he told me that the main reason why I'm having some issues there is because my left calf muscle is tighter than my right. And I'm like, what the hell? Why, why is it tight? I don't understand. And when I went to physical therapy, he started massaging it and trying to loosen it. And then I started to notice like a lot of pain at the top when he was doing it. And I was like, what the hell? So after trying to do some stretches and stuff, what I do now before I do any kind of physical activity, tennis, running, football, whatever, um, I really stretch out my heels. I do them both of them. Um, this can come in a single or doubles. Uh, the doubles, that's what these two little holes for. It's one piece. The doubles would be, you'll have this one here and another one here, and they'll be connected with two little cylinders. Um, you can do them at the same time. I wish I would have done that, uh, but I wasn't sure. Um... What I was thinking of doing was buying another one of these and then just getting the, the two little cylinder thingies. But the problem is they don't sell them like that. And I could not find where I can buy those two. I would have to buy another set. I would have to buy a set of two, which is kind of BS. So I have no idea where to find that online. If anybody knows where I can get that, uh, comment and let me know. I mean, there is a website here. I went to it. Uh, I don't think you can see it. But I couldn't find it. So... What this is good for, you go on the wall. This, this is the manual for the Pro Stretch Plus, but you see the idea here. You'll just be doing that with this. Uh, so the next step, what I'm going to talk about is the Pro Stretch Plus and the difference between the two. This is what I got recently. Now, I do a mixture of both. I use, not at the same time. Um... This one right here, Pressure X Plus, I tend to get a more of a stretch. I don't know why. I think it's because it's bigger and wider. As you can see, this is one piece. This is, has multiple pieces. It has this toe piece right here. You can do it without the toe piece for beginners. Um, put the toe piece on for, you, for a deeper stretch. You could also take this piece off here. If I can get it off, move it up here for more of a deeper stretch. Now the only issue I had with this one is, this is for now anyways, if anybody decides to get these, get this one. Um, the reason why is because this one, even though that it does what it's supposed to do, there's a big fault in design. And one of the main things, and I know a lot of people have had this, this piece right here, I don't know why, but this piece right here, uh, when I, this is my replacement. Uh, the first one I got, it worked for maybe about a week and a half or so. And then when I was stretching, this piece just popped right off. And I was like, what the hell? So I put it back on, tried to do it, it kept popping off. I was like, what the hell? So as you can see, there's these little divots where it, it sinks in. It's also right here. Right here. It, it just wouldn't stay in place anymore. So what I did, um, I tried some glue. It worked for a little bit and it kept popping off. I was like, this is BS, so I couldn't use this anymore. This does cost a little bit more than this version. Uh, I think maybe five bucks more, ten bucks more. So I sent it back. They sent me a new one. So now what I did with this one when I got it is um, I got some super glue for plastic binding, whatever. And I put a little bit here, 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 and these three sides right here. You know, because I want this to be secure before I even started using it. Um, that is the main issue I had with this one, and I don't recommend getting this. It does it does the job when it works but because of this black piece right here it that's where the main issue is I mean you can get it but if you do get it I recommend super gluing this with the 
plastic uh, binding glue, some uh, the really strong stuff that helps with uh, when you're using it on plastic. Um, other than that, it does a good job, but only when it works. If I recommend you get this one until they fix this problem. So hopefully uh, it'll make you know change your mind or help you decide. Um, this is a little diagram of Pro Stretch Plus. The different little exercises that it comes with. Uh, you got your calves here. This is uh, the main main idea. This is instructions and all that. Shows you how to use it. Um, again, like I said, if you do choose between one of these two, uh, get the Pro Stretch, the original. There are others that look similar to this. Um, you know, um, um, you know, they look almost exactly the same, just a different brand. So, I, you know, whichever you prefer, but if you do get the Pro Stretch Plus, um, hopefully yours doesn't break. Um, I don't think it was just, it was just mine. You know, I think that uh, other people have that issue as well. Um, just because of this damn piece right here, this fucking piece. You know, but um, I, I do like using this though. Like I said, I get more of a stretch than this one. I, I mean, they both look about the same. If you can see that. You know, and uh, I think it's because this is taller. I could get more of a stretch. You know, I, I don't know. But hopefully this uh, video lets you decide which one you should get. I recommend the Pro Stretch over the Pro Stretch Plus. At least until they fix this problem. When they do, then go ahead and get it. Um, they should just make this piece one solid piece attached to this. They shouldn't even make it a separate plastic piece that is not designed to come off. I mean, it, it comes off, but it's not supposed to. So hopefully they will fix that problem. Uh, you can get this device on Amazon or ProStretchPlus.com if you're looking for this one. Um, you can you also find this one as well on Medidyne.com. I don't know if you can see that. So hopefully this will let you know, give you a better idea. If you have any questions, uh, send me a comment. Um, yeah, alright. That's it.